Hey everyone, welcome to another pour video. In today's video, I'm using Kami Pigments again. And I added a couple more colors in there. Um, I was just tired of using the primary colors. And I'm not super awesome at mixing up the secondary colors. I also find that they're not really as pure as when you buy secondary colors from the store. So I've really got to go back to Kami Pigments again and pick myself up some secondary colors. So the frame that I'm using on this canvas is a frame from um, that failed Vortex pour. Uh, I just didn't like the painting enough to justify keeping um, the canvas on the frame. So I restretched it and that's what I'm using today. And I made myself a new tool. Um, it's inspired by a snowplow. Uh, we've been getting a lot of snow recently in Montreal. And I cut up a like a paper towel roll and I covered it in packing tape and I used that. The whole idea was to shoot the paint up and over and kind of curl it. And I th it did a surprisingly good job. Um, I think that maybe next time I won't be so violent with my shooping. But it, it definitely created a really interesting uh, kind of energetic uh, effect, I think. So I played with the paint at the bottom a bit, but I think that it it was kind of, uh, I lost all the cool effects that I got from it when I started spinning the canvas, but that was okay because um, it turned those um, shoopy lines into wings, I think. Um, I was just so impressed with <laughs> what the spinning did this time around. Uh, I think that it ended up looking really cool. So I'm doing this thing where I paint for a fair amount of time and then I turn off the camera and I go away and I think about it. And then I end up coming back to the painting and turning on the camera again and everything. Um, unfortunately, the messing around with the camera, I think that for a small portion of this video, I must have like smudged the lens or something. And it's kind of foggy just for one part, so I'm sorry about that, but, uh, and it sucks because it was, like, during the part where I put a, a ribbon on this, so, um, anyways, I apologize for the brief fogginess. I decided to put a ribbon on, uh, just because, like, I felt like it was missing something. I didn't know what, um but I wanted to add something to it. So it was re really difficult for me to do because I was really enjoying uh, what the wings were doing, but it had to be done. So I decided that my bird needed a kind of a head. So I made this really abstracty head and I decided that it was a little too bulky on the one side of the painting. So I ended up coming back and uh, just scraping off a, a good portion of the paint. Uh, I wasn't super happy with the cells in the part that I scraped off anyways. So I was really happy that I decided to scrape off the paint and make it maybe a little more delicate, I guess you would say. Um, I actually ended up being really happy with this painting. Um, I, I think that it looks pretty cool. So I hope you liked it too, and I hope you liked watching my video. If you did, remember to hit like, and make sure that you've subscribed to my channel. Thanks for watching. I hope that you have a great day. Bye.